sa inyo minsan yung mentioned about the build, build, build at saka yung BPOs. In addition mm -hmm. to what you mentioned today, kasama naman po doon sa digital infra, ano po yung, uh, ano nyo dito sir, direction? While uh, extensively na-discuss nyo po yung uh, mga ilang, mga, pa, pun, ano to, mga, ano, uh, kailangan mga sektor para tayo bumangon muli. Ito sir, sa BPOs, narinig ko po kayo nagsalta dito and doon sa build, build, build. Mm. Yung, yung sa build, 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 kaya pagpatuloy talaga natin yan. Infrastructure is always critical. Hindi talaga mawawala yan. That's why napag-usapan ko mga airport, yung mga alsanda doon sa mga tourist yes. destinations. Uh, and we we'll need to open up other places. Ang gawin, ka, um, yun lamang, we have to now create for ourselves a plan. Ano bang plano? Saan ba tayo talaga maglalagay ng... ng uh, sa, ano ba yung gusto nating i-investan? Ano ba yung gusto talaga natin na uh, unahin? At yun, di, di gawin priority yung, mga, yung, yung transport and communication dun sa mga lugar na yun. Uh, and that's where we... We, we not only continue the build, build, build program of President Duterte, but we build upon it. And uh, we will make it even more extensive, uh, but it will be conform in, conform in conformation to a larger plan, uh, to in a, a larger plan of uh, economic development. So there will be, there will have to be a long term. We have to sit down and make a long term plan. And uh, for example, we just what industries are we going to? Uh, are we going to uh, first uh, attend to? You know, ano yung mga unahan natin? Will it be manufacturing? Will it be IT? Will it be BPO? BPO kasi uh, has always been, has been, even through the pandemic, has been still a constant source of, uh, ano, may, meron tayong income dyan. Marami, marami pang nakakapagtrabaho because natural, because the nature of the BPO is that uh, you can work from home or you can be isolated, you can have a bubble. Uh, so all of these things are possible. So yung BPO, siyempre, eh, successful you invest in success. Kung successful yung industriya, eh, dun, tayo, dun tayo maglalagay. But beyond just following success, we also have to make a long-term plan. Uh, the successful economies around the world, hindi lang sumunod kung saan yung marami yung export nila. Uh, ang ginawa nila, nag-isip sa saan ba tayo at saan, na, saan natin gustong sumikat ang bayan natin. Uh, let's say, for example, uh, South Korea. South Korea chose uh, where it will invest. And one of the first things that they invested in is the digital infrastructure uh, because nakita na nila yun ang mangyayari. So that, uh, that, that, that infrastructure development is going to be... Uh, dapat yung digital infra, whenever we talk about infra, kasama na yung digital. Uh, dahil oh. talaga naging critical na talaga sa... Uh, naging critical talaga sa ano natin yan, uh, sa ekonomiya natin yan. So it all it all goes hand in hand. Uh, the, the, that's why, as I said, we cannot just say, oh, we'll, we'll build up infra, we'll build up IT, we'll build up BPO. No, we have to have a plan. How do we bring all of these things together? Yeah. And how do, we, how do we relate this to our partners abroad? Uh, how do we relate this to the global economy and what will be our place and what, where do we want to be? Unang una. Where do we want to be? How do we get there? And then you implement that plan. So there is a short-term plan so that there is immediate employment and there is a long-term plan to make that employment, to make the economy more robust. Yun ang, yun ang ating, uh, uh, in, yun ang dapat natin na tignan na mabuti. Uh, the, you know, there, there are so many technologies that are coming up, and I think that uh, uh, we should take advantage of them.